Oh, it may be November, but I just can't get enough at these centers. Two is not enough, my friend. Two is certainly not enough. I'm serious, that's enough. Give it up. It is 9 p.m. I woke up at eight this morning. I have done myself a good 13 hours of this day and I feel good about it. That, ah. It's funny how yesterday I made that video talking about how I didn't feel like I'd accomplished much, meh, meh, much with my day. Um, I'm tired already. <laughs> I'm always tired when I do these vlog entries. Um, yeah, I didn't feel like I'd accomplished much. And so today I thought, let's, let's just go. Let's just do it. And I did it and I feel good. Um, as far as the evening goes, I have not been as productive as I was in the morning, but that's just natural. Um, I woke up and I literally, I, I just got up and I did the things I had to do, the admin, the order stuff, the website stuff. Uh, I then shot, edited and uploaded the Jamie Pine Show episode. Um, and that was done within two hours. And that is a record. That is a two hours. I suppose it was an easy topic. And I want to talk more about that topic later on in this video. Um, but yeah, no, I just feel good about that. And then, and then Sophia came around, my friend. Um, and we went to walk her dog. I vlogged it. Um, I will edit that vlog and get that up as soon as I've edited the other five vlogs that I've missed so far. <laughs> um, so I've got a lot of editing to do. Still didn't get the Maybe Monday video done. That was the plan. I thought, okay, I'm going to come home, my video is going to publish, and I'm going to be like, yeah, that's great, time to edit a Maybe video and a vlog, and then I'm going to go to bed feeling great. I still feel great, but I've done neither of the two. I've edited a bit of the Maybe vlog, but it's not finished. Still a bit to go. I might still do that before I go to bed. I might. I might, but I'm tired, and I want to wake up early tomorrow as well. I have college tomorrow. So, yeah, that's that, and, um, yeah, I just, I did good. So this Asena O'Neill drama that's going on on YouTube right now, since I've made my video, I have seen a bunch of other wonderful people make videos about this topic. You have Dodie, you have, oh, I don't know, I've seen a load. <laughs> Dodie's was good, check it out. Um, yeah, so a lot of people have put in their two cents, and uh, I feel like the, the topic is being discussed appropriately. Uh, obviously there are a few people uh, in, my, in the comments of my videos, as expected, as usual, just kind of causing, not argument, but discussion. And I like that, so I'm answering them to the best of my ability, uh, and hoping not to piss people off. Because uh, that's not what the purpose of this. The purpose of this was to talk about the topic and come to some, or at least battle the kind of drama. Because ultimately, like Dodie said in her video, the media, and they have since then, caught on to this as a topic and have blown it out of proportion. They're going to blow it further out of proportion. You know, you have a, a vlogger... Uh, a, a, a an Instagram star, a celebrity, the, the, the one of the most controversial kinds of celebrities, almost the internet celebrities, turning around and saying it's all fake. Uh, I quit because I wasn't happy. Um, I just don't feel like she executed it in the best way. I said that in my video. Uh, but more juicy news has come out since then. Um, let's find it on the computer here. This video. Don't know if you can see that. This video, these two girls, I will link in the description. Um, they came out with some inside juice about Asena and, and, and how her life really was. And they, they did that the old style of looking at her video, chopping it up, and then just making comments. And it really shed some new light on the situation that I just feel is... It, it makes sense. They basically, to summarize, talk about how... Uh, she wasn't really living this huge, successful life that she made out to be living. Of course, she was successful. She had brand deals. She had everything you can expect from an account with half a million followers on Instagram. Uh, and, you know, 300,000 subscribers uh, on YouTube. I've managed to start a business and make myself a living out of just short of 100,000 subscribers. I mean, look at this. This is a merch store. 
in my in in a room in my house and you know I have a third of what she had on one social media site so I get it you can make money um, but she kind of blew it out of proportion and I think I I think this video kind of details why uh, they, they go on to talk about the the fact that when she was in LA and she didn't have a visa to work in LA so she wasn't there on work purposes it was a vacation and she met this guy who was more famous rich had nice cars had it all uh, they were in love supposedly and just at the pinnacle of where she was living this crazy life that she built up for it all came crumbling down on her her boyfriend dumped her in LA supposedly and now don't get me wrong I know how that can affect someone and I know that it makes sense to look at the way she's handled this situation, the way she's almost wanted to reinvent herself and, and slate the platform in, in which that led her into this situation of, of being, you know, of having her heart broken. So I, I kind of get, I, it kind of makes sense to me. Now, don't, this is all just presumptions. This could be all bullshit. I'm just thinking out loud. Um, but, uh, you know, if this, if that was true, then it makes sense that, that you know, she reacted like this and, and did what she did and said what she said. So, uh, you know, it, it, it seems more logical that it was just a case of a bad breakup blown way out of proportion that is now turned into a giant media frenzy that is going to make every single vlogger on YouTube question what they're doing. There you go. That's how to make, uh, make some noise from, from a breakup. Either way, I recommend you go watch that video. Uh, I'm just kind of, I haven't even finished it yet. I've watched, I watched four minutes out of 15 minutes. So Jesus, don't, don't quote me if they completely turn it all around in the video, but that's just based on what I have seen so far. I'm not gonna watch the rest right now. I might do before I go to bed, but I'm going to bed now. I dropped, oh God, I did do that. I am sorry, what way were you? You were, you were this way. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, so I'm in a good mood today. Um, that's crazy. I'm just, I'm all over the place. Tomorrow I'm going to be like, I hate my life. <laughs> I don't, but there you go. Thank you guys uh, for watching these vlogs and I'm happy to know that I have some form of little audience uh, there that care about the kind of unedited me, just me talking. It's cool. I like this. I'm really enjoying this so far. Um, so that's the name of that game. Um, this is six minutes long, so I'm, I'm gonna let you guys go. You have yourselves a good day, because this is probably going out tomorrow, or in the middle of the night. Yeah, this is coming out in the middle of the night tonight. So, hi night people, or Australians. <laughs> um, yeah, so, stay awesome, and smile. I will see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Bye!